Okay, so yeah, so we're just going to continue on. Um, because obviously talking about Marvel, let's jump into the next subject, which actually involves Marvel. Mm-hmm. Um, Marvel's been talking about their new slate. They just released their new sizzle reel mm-hmm. and showing all the all the new shit that's about to drop. Some that's as it some dropped already, or some's about to drop. About and to drop, yeah. That's coming. Yeah, yeah. Boy, the list is good. Um, mm-hmm. Interesting, interesting. Yeah. What were you excited about? I mean, look, bro. If you can remember the list. Yeah, no, I mean, Daredevil was there. Ironheart yeah. was there. Wonder yeah. Man was there. What If Season 3 was there. Um, Eye of Wakanda, the new Wakanda show was there. Yeah, I was surprised to see that. Uh, your Friendly Neighborhood Spider-Man, new, that, that new show yeah. was there. Yeah, yeah, um, that was dope. Yeah, I'm not going to lie, bro. I'm not going to lie. Me, personally, I'm most excited for the return of Daredevil. Hands down, like, for me, it's not even a, not even do, do you feel close. Like that show was like a sleeper hit? Like, um, when I say sleep hit, it was more of like, it was surprising as to how good it actually was. 100%. I think, as well, it proved that people can do superhero. It, remember, let's always remember, it was Netflix. who kind of got on saying, obviously, it was under the Marvel banner, but Netflix kind of show run that, etc., it proved just how good those type of shows can be done if they're done in a gritty, realistic mm. way. Yeah. The kind of guy was saying the violence was hardcore. The the action scenes, that hall, the hallway scene is like, absolutely iconic. You've got um, Vincent Straight D'Onofrio. Out, oh boy. Vincent D'Onofrio is still one of the most bad yeah. man villains as well. It's Vincent yeah. D'Onofrio. But, yeah, 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 and yeah, and, yeah. and my, my man Punisher, John Burfell up in yeah. there bad man as well so yeah, yeah. i am gas and i'm glad because remember there was rumors originally it was they were written it this this version was more of a legal procedure um show Is and that he what he was gonna... yeah he wow. wasn't supposedly he wasn't gonna put on a daredevil costume to like episode five or six and then that came out foggy and all that karen they weren't coming back that mm. came out the fan buzz was like nah went no, back to the drawing we board having that now if now everybody back now vincent back foggy back Karen back it's hardcore it's violent so that's what i'm most looking forward to um yourself so far what what yourself of the show i can't lie like i didn't even finish the end of the last the last daredevil Mm. season i saw the season before like daredevil yeah i was fully impressed by daredevil i'm looking forward to seeing daredevil because it yeah Vincent D'Onofrio you kind of said it to me honest. everything I just don't mm. want to repeat everything you said to spot on like Daredevil good villain good show mm. it's just good that the friggin uh, original Ben Affleck movie didn't tarnish the series because I know at the beginning when it first started people thought why are you making Daredevil the film was yeah. shit not yeah. realising that yeah. nah, that film was shit yeah. let someone else do it properly and then this is what, this is what you get because the series completely different from the film mm. in terms of performances and just the gritty look worked mm. yeah it was sick. It was sick. Like, it was sick. It was sick. yeah it's like it gives you a do you know what i liked about it? it's like daredevil and luke cage have a mm. very similar feel and i don't know if it's because they're both set in different parts of new york yeah but yeah, yeah, yeah. like how they show the grittiness and the, the color grading the color schemes and mm. it, it almost looks realistic comic booky and it yeah. sounds so weird but they really no, but captured it, worked. it. I think that's why yeah. people are so attached to definitely those two shows of the Netflix shows yeah. and Jessica Jones. I guess I think people did like that um, yeah. as well. It was only um, Iron Fist that would no one liked. No one, no one thoughts about that. That never happened. <laughs> but um, yeah, but no, yeah. yeah, Daredevil, the freaking Spider Man card. Like, mm, I feel like. Sick. They they was like yeah X Men ninety seven did well let's uh, <laughs> let's 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 uh, try do it again yeah yeah yeah, yeah. yeah. and let's go, yeah. let's, yeah, let's go back to basics let's make it friendly neighbor Spider Man it's, it's, it's a lot cheaper and uh, yeah yeah we can get yeah let's get it done get it there yeah. Yeah. yeah I reckon that shit came out the week after that was also also as well basically. I am sure after the success of Spider Verse spider verse two them motherfuckers yeah. they were like eh, they was like we, we need a spider-man show we need a spider-man yeah, cartoon we need to right ever now, make right another now. live spider-man they're probably <laughs> bruv i'm telling you right spider-man now they're in the boardroom thinking like cover it up we don't need that no more i literally cover it up cover, cover it up we don't need that no more Put, listen <laughs> tell tom he's fired don't need that don't need that <laughs> Tell, tell the rest of the man, tell Andrew, <laughs> <laughs> tell Toby, we ain't going to need you guys back. We're good. Literally, we're just going to pump gonna, our cartoons. Just going to run it by cartoons. It don't even matter. Uh, we might get you lot back new voiceovers, but that's it.